so far. Just now adding the dry ingredients. Should have let my cream cheese sit out longer. If you wonder what swerve looks like. It's, a li it's not completely white. Dollar Tree. Three fifty. Are you kidding? Three fifty for about thirty five minutes. So I just put the cake in the oven. I'm fixing a wrap. It's a little after 12, I think. Um, I had coffee, two big cups of coffee this morning with my new Swerve. So I'm starting to get hungry. I'm gonna show you what my wrap is. I just don't like filming when people are here. That's why I can't wait for us to get into a house. I feel weird. I don't wanna be judged. So I'll show you stuff, but I usually don't talk because there's people here. So that's it. I can't wait for this cake. I hope it turns out really well okay so my recipe calls for it to bake for 35 minutes and i put it in for 30 and it's now been 34 minutes and it's still kind of jiggly not gonna lie it smells really eggy almost disappointed <clears throat> i don't know about this look watch you see how it's still like jiggly Jiggly? Is it supposed to do that? How do I even check this? So I flipped her over real quick to let her kind of cool. And <clears throat> I just made the icing. So we'll see. Fixing to put it back in there, but I think I made enough icing. It would have probably been better if I had had some of the Swerve Confectioner, but I don't. So this is what we're gonna deal with for now. So I tried it. I It says to let it cool completely. I, you know, cut me a piece. You can still kind of see a little bit of the um, cream cheese that didn't fully get, you know, mixed. I think the icing would be better if it was used with confectioner sugar, not the granulated swerve. So it still smells so eggy. There's a slight vanilla, I mean, not vanilla, lemon. I, next time I would definitely add more to the cake part, the um, more lemon, but I'm gonna put it in the fridge like it suggests and I will try it either tonight or tomorrow after it's been sitting and it's cool because it may be a lot better, but as of right now, it's pretty good. I mean, it's not horrible. It's really moist. I just don't like that you can taste the almond flour. It's not lemony as I wanted. So, I mean, the icing is okay. Coconut flour probably would do good next time. 